Hey there, my big boys. How you doing today? If I play a little bit off, it's because I'm playing on a new keyboard. Oh my god, there's already things on. Whoa! What the heck is going on, dude? As soon as I start the friggin' video, we're just exploding things already. I don't know if it was last time. I don't know if you guys remember, but we, like, got completely rocked by several gigantic ghouls and super minions and, like, oh my goodness, super whatever they are, super mutants, and all this crazy random crap was just straight up owning us. Oh man, there's some people over here. I hope, hopefully they're good people. There's some bad people over there. These might be good people. They don't seem like they're too bad. Hello? They're caravan <laughs> guards. Don't eye the Brahmin if you got any sense. <clears throat> got armor at good rates if you're... My armor saved many a wasteland. Bit. I've got a few minutes to browse. Focus on stopping power. Pretty, don't stop bullets. Ooh, I like him. Champion left arm, 737 caps, though. That is pretty boss, though. I think I might come back to this guy eventually. Oh my god, 16,000 caps? What? How the heck am I supposed to afford that crap? Alright, so obviously we're out of here, but... You know what? Just to note this guy for next time. So I don't know if you guys remember what we're doing. Oh, there's a bridge. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Is there going to be bottle cap mines over here? Let's save. Let's save just in case something really bad happens on this bridge. Bridges always have mines. That's why I just run and jump over. Just try run and jump, run and jump, run and jump. So surprisingly, no death claws or anything yet. Nothing uh, legendary yet. Oh, we're less than 100 meters away. Woo! Things are actually going pretty reasonably smooth. So basically what I do is every... every Uh-oh. We're getting rads. Is that a deer? Is it a deer over there? That's kind of cool. I guess we'll stay on the road for a little while until we get going here. I might want to get my, my AP back, though, just in case uh, I have to run from something. Hey, we discovered County Crossing! We made it! Awesome! So, I, like I was saying, I don't know if you guys remember hey what happened last time, really use your but we just got owned by everybody. I'm with the Minutemen. How can I help? Something nasty's living just around the corner from here. It's only a matter of time before there's some real trouble. What's really too bad is it'd be a nice spot for a new settlement. In fact, I know some folks that'd love to set up there if it was safe. If you can make sure the old workshop there is still in one piece, anyone who decides to move in later will be able to rebuild. No problem. I'll take care of them for you. I hope so. We didn't know what to do. All right, sweet man. So what do we got in here? We got some stuff for me. Ooh, no. Everybody's owning stuff. I can't like this is like seriously like the area where everybody is Don't just. Don't care much for good neighbor. That place is nothing but trouble. Good neighbor. So where are we going? Where are we going, man? We're supposed to go to. Let's get rid of this thing. Remove marker. Is that really where I'm supposed to go? Oh, we're supposed to go to County Crossing. See, here's the problem, guys. My quests are so messed up right now. Clearing the way for County Crossing. Okay, that's what we're doing. That's what we're going to do. So we need to... Why? Why is this one here? Sunshine Tidings. Hmm, interesting. No, we're in County Crossing. We are supposed to go over that. It doesn't make much sense at all. All right, let's try it, man. Let's go to dumb. Let's whatever. Let's just finish some stuff. <laughs> as long as we're getting something done, I guess that's a good thing, right? But what I want to do is I want to go to Diamond City fairly soon because I feel like it's a good thing for me to actually go and complete some of the Who's regular there? missions. I'm a what? <laughs> what? 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 Why are we just randomly coming into billions of people like as soon as we spawn? Hello, my friend. Cha 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 and super death. <laughs> we seriously just spawned into raiders. We spawned into a uh, explosion. We spawned into road leathers. Ooh, ooh, we're getting tons of bullets from these guys. This is awesome. Plus, this gun actually isn't that bad. I bet you if we hit people with it too, it'd be pretty reasonably good. So which way are we heading? We're heading down here. So I actually feel reasonably safe over here. I don't feel like there's gonna be giant death claws or. Or like, I don't know. 
super crazy, legendary, feral ghoul attack monsters coming after me. I don't feel like any of that's going to happen to us in this general area. Because it's kind of like where we started. You know, we started in the top left corner of the map. Uh, and this is basically the top left corner of the map. Um, so... That... We've got company. The heck is a rad stick? Oh, is that one of those deers? Is it angry at me? <laughs> that thing was really easy to kill. Alright, and we jump on the little trucky looking thing. I think it's a truck. So that was weird. Why was it like... Why was he all angry about it? He's like, we got company, man! Oh, so there's some more peeps. There they are. Oh, bring it, little buddy. Oh, did you fall down? Oh, no, there he is. Oh, oh, oh! oh! What the? Headshots. Come on, get him. Two headshots. Yeah! Oh, my God! How did he go 20 feet in the air? That was awesome! And his gun is flipping all over the place, man. Oh, goodness gracious. Gah. Any more of them? No, I think that's it. That's all of them. By the way, the way I look for enemy... Oh, what? Oh, my God. It scared me. Uh, the way I look for enemies, a lot of times, I just go like this really quick, and I look at the bottom part of the map to see if there's any red dots. And that's usually the easiest way to figure out if there's people or not. So... I have to start not taking everything. So here's the guy that flew up a billion feet in the air. And we're off. We found Walden Pond. Woo! Maybe there's something cool in here. There's probably all irradiated mussels and mirelurks and crap in here. We're gonna get radiation poison. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, so don't go in there. See, it's weird, because I have, like, minus 15 radiation or something, so it doesn't really... It doesn't seem like it does as much damage until I get in there, and then all of a sudden, bam, shazam, dude, plus 3 radiation per second. It's ridiculous. So I'm going kind of the wrong way now. Got to adjust accordingly. And we're in a very, very dangerous place. Oh, man, the stars are so beautiful. This is actually what the stars would probably look like if there was no light anywhere. This music definitely makes me think like there's always something behind me. Or just gonna pop out of the ground or something just gonna ma massively attack me. Or packs of dogs will just destroy me. I guess that's what makes it fun is you don't know what is gonna happen. It's kind of random. So we made it to the Sunshine Tidings Co-op. Oh. Oh, hello, everybody. Whoa, man. <laughs> he sounds like he's high. So what am I actually doing here? It's gonna be hard to sneak up on anything in here. Clear the enemies. Where be some enemies? Anybody in here? Let's just run around until we find somebody. There's probably some ghouls in here, man. I bet you any money. Oh! Oh, there is! There's ghouls in here! Oh! Oh! Oh, it really did scare me. Even though I knew they were going to be here, they still scared the crap out of me. See, if I have when I have good aim, I feel good. So there we go. Oh, look at that, man. Far out. That was not far out. That was scary out. Alright, so we took care of two of these guys. But now we know there are definitely ghouls and stuff in here. <sighs> man. I, it's cool because I actually uh, I leave the sound on really, really loud. Which definitely does, obviously, make me uh, get way more scared way quicker. Plus, ghouls are just freaky, man. They really are. With the surround sound and everything. So we got an outhouse over here. Ooh, interesting. With a bobby pin box. Three bobby pins. Wouldn't there be like a hundred bobby pins in a bobby pin box? Yeah, you're right. That would be a little unfair. Oh, my goodness. There we go. It was a little tight, but, you know, that's the way I like it. So there's a little... Little rad roach in here. Three bullets to take down a rad roach. Obviously, it's because I suck and I missed. But why is there bone saws and things in here? This is, is kind of scary. Should we sleep? 
Hey, why not? Let's regenerate all of our delicious little health. Bourbon. A broken lamp and a battered something. Wait, what was that? Oh, a dirty black suit. No, I don't want a dirty black suit. And we get a lot of cool stuff in here. I guess whenever you whenever you open up... Oh, double rad X's. Whoop, whoop, whoo! That's what I like to see, my friends. That's what I like to hear. That's what I like to see. That's what I like to not fight ghouls right now. Is this one alive? Okay, thank goodness. Just to be safe. <laughs> Just to be safe. <laughs> Alright, so did we technically beat it? Oh, wait. Oh, I see. There is... More to kill over here. We've got to clear out everything. There's probably just two more enemies in here. Yeah, we can handle them. Let's just shoot through the windows, if we can. I don't think they can get out. Oh, they kind of can. Oh, the door opened! Why did the door open? Ah. Okay, ready? One, two, three, four. Take him down. Chicka-boom, chicka-boom. And he's still alive. Come on, come on. Get it going, get it going. And we get, was that 18 experience? Why are we getting 18 experience for these guys? That's awesome, though. I love it. And we get some rounds. We actually get some rounds. So are there more pe Oh, there is. There's more peeps for us to kill. I love it. Let's see what's inside here first. So somebody told me in one of my previous videos that I should put all of my things... Oh, yes. Oh. The wall. Oh, pocketed metal right leg and a gold watch. That was an awesome trunk, industrial trunk. Some brain fungus. I will take some brain fungus and some entats. So we have way too much stuff to hold. Somebody was telling me that what I should do is I should put all of my <clears throat> junk inside, like, one of the things where you, like, build things. I can't not figure out how to do it. Um... Yeah, I don't, I don't know how to do it, so if you guys want to help me out with that, it would help me a bunch of bunch. Because I just want to get rid of all of my crap. I'm usually one of those people where I almost carry, I carry almost nothing the entire time. So I have four of these pistols again. All right, of course I do. Of course I do. All right, come on, get out of my way. Let's see, we got one more. I don't know, let's just go, let's just go building to building. Just take them all down. <laughs> Again, just to be safe, I suppose. It's always a good thing to check around. I shouldn't even be looking for things. I already can't hold anything, man. But, oh, oh, oh. What the heck is this? Glowing fungus. Mm, interesting. We should keep moving. Shut up, dude. Shut up. So there's the last little building in there. I think there is probably... Oh, wait. Oh, wait, yeah, no, we got the workshop already. Boom, shazoom. So, anyways, I don't know, like, how to, um, like, put my stuff in here. That's what, that's what people were telling me to do. Put my stuff, like, in the workshop, which does not make much sense to me. Resources. Um. Like, I don't, I don't understand how to, how to do it. Uh. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to build anything really. Decorations, furniture, structures. A chemistry station. That's kind of cool. Ooh, fancy that. Okay, so let's exit out of this really quick. Let's see if we can unlock it, man. Let's see what's going on over here. Ooh, ruled. Decay. Uh. Rests. All right, we gotta restart, man. We gotta restart. I think you only get four tries, right? So let's see. A little groups, James, and Andy. Oh, no. All right, there we go. I'm just guessing most of the time. These are mostly there's some mostly easy. I don't know what I did. OK. 
Okay, he's on guard mode right now. Ooh, this is interesting. I don't think I'm actually going to ever use any of these things. I suppose it's a possibility, but I just don't think I will. Oh god, what did I do? See, I can tell you, my keyboard's getting all messed up, dude. So, oh wait, oh, transfer, there we go, hold on. R, oh, there we go. Now we can put all of our crap in here. Oh, I should probably do this off camera, but, but, but I'm not going to. Uh, basically anything, see, this is kind of cool, man. I don't know what the heck this is, but... It looks like it's awesome. Fire rate 127? Yeah, that is that is fast. Let's get rid of all of our duct tape, fancy hairbrush, fiber optics, flip lighter, fuse. Look at that, man. Look at all the stuff we can get rid of. Buttercup back leg. Oh, yeah, there's a lot of stuff, dude. Hi, honey. I don't even know what this is. Lantern. Yeah, we're almost done, man. I got a melon. Melons are good to keep in here. Duct tape. Mutt fruit. Nuclear material. What the heck do you do with that? You sell it? Shouldn't I be getting some stuff from this? I don't know. An oven mitt. Some packs of cigarettes. You get a lot of stuff. You get plastic, cloth, and asbestos from cigarettes. That is that is just weird. Oh, this is a quest item. A perception bobblehead. Cool. I didn't realize it was worth $300. Can I use that thing? I didn't know I could actually use those things. Anyways, we're almost done here, guys. We're just putting everything in here. There's another repair bobblehead. so Or it's a different bobblehead. So... I gotta remember to start using the Righteous Authority. This thing is boss, but I don't think I have that many bullets left for it. Scissors, screwdrivers, and we are in the S's already. We got silver fork, silver locket, pocket watch, knife. Super Mutant's orders. A table knife? Or is it a tactical knife? I didn't even see. What's a tar berry? <laughs> Just a berry. All right. Some thistle, I suppose. Why not? Here we go. Here's all the crap, dude. Oops. I wasn't sure if I was supposed to get rid of that or not. But that was only like 40 weight, so I guess 40 weight does help. But it wasn't like ridiculous or anything like that. So it looks like I think we are done. We just have to head back to that other area, right? Yeah! So I think what we're going to do is we're going to... After we do this... We're going to either talk to Paladin Dance, or we're going to go to Diamond City and try and find my son. Hey, at least it's honest work. Who's selling things? Ahem. Make a hey move there. and I'll Doc Weathers you. is guaranteed to pass up any bruises, holes, and diseases. Whoa, was that thing angry at me? Wait, do I get to steal their meat for free? <gasps> No, it's just a cooking station. I could steal everything from over here, though. That would be awesome, man. Steal everything. I cleared that place out for you. Should be safe for your friends to move in now. I didn't get a thank you. I didn't. Oh, nice to have some good news around go. here. Finally. For a change. By the way, we've decided to support the Minutemen. We've got to help each other if we want things to get better. Sweet titties, man. Sweet titties. This is what we love to see. So where's... Pr oh, Preston. Preston. By the way, I had to get rid of dog right. meat to make Preston follow me. I'm not sure if I want to do that. What now? We can finally start to think about more than just survival. We've gotten big enough that we're having trouble communicating with all our settlements. It's a good problem to have, and I have a solution. I think it's time to retake the castle. It used to be the Men and Men HQ, way before my time. Well fortified centrally located and most important it has a powerful radio transmitter we can use to broadcast to the whole commonwealth it sounds like just what we need right now <laughs> i thought you'd like the idea so should i have an assault force assemble near the castle 
Yeah, let's do this. We'll do some recon and meet you outside the castle. See you there. Oh yeah, dude. I'm gonna I'm gonna do this mission. This just sounds like a cool mission. But where is the castle? Oh, it's far. It's all the way down there. How far have I gone down? I've not gone there yet. I haven't gone there yet. Why do I have all these places? Like, I can see them, but I haven't had, like, actually done anything to them yet. I don't know. But now we're probably going to have to <laughs> fight a lot of things on the way to the castle. Almost guaranteed. So let's make sure we save. First things first, man. We've done a, a pretty ridiculously awesome amount of stuff. Let's save it up. And let's, uh, get going. Yes. Alright, so we're still in, like, a, t a kind of towny area. I guess it was kind of cool, because I was kind of expecting, like, everywhere to be open space. And then, like, the only places that are things are when you go into a town or something. But that is not the case, um, based on last the last video that we just had. It was, like, the entire town was gigantic. So we got to be very careful of bottle cap mines and crap. I don't know. I can't even see them, dude. I'll be honest with you guys. I just, I just feel like running and jumping over them and just hoping, <laughs> just hoping for the best here. So we made it to the wreck of the USS Riptide. Oh, can I cross this thing? Okay, thank goodness. Thank goodness, I better have been able to, because it would have been kind of upset. Looks very beautiful. A little pretty sunset. Wee. So I hear gunfire. Should we go help the gunfire out? I don't know. Where's it coming from? Definitely coming from this way. Where's that drums? <laughs> what? Oh god, it's getting louder. I hear explosions now. Are these good bad guys? These guys are probably good. Oh. Let's see. Let's get. Let's go one of those. Uh, those cool guns out, man. What do we got? So what do we got? A uh, bayonet, calibrated pipe, revolver, sniper. Let's check this bad boy out. Oh, I totally thought I had him there. I hit him again. The stupid pipes in the way. Super Mutant Skirmisher. Oh, we got a crap ton of bullets for these things, too. This is awesome. Oh, it's a lot harder to snipe than it looks. Woo! 25 experience, too. That's pretty boss. Why are they getting out of here, dude? We're taking out. I guess they have a lot of health. Then again, I mean, it's pretty easy just to snipe from back here. They, like, can't reach me almost at all. Woo! Took him down, and... Ah, that guy's just... You just, like, can't hit him for some reason. He's either got a bajillion health, or I'm not hitting him. I don't understand. It looks like I'm hitting him. It's like making the little, like, hit noise. There we go. Ah, uh, there we go. See, I don't think it was hitting him. Damn. Not afraid of mutants, huh? You're our kind of guy. Looking for Diamond City? Just follow the signs. Oh, we're gonna get a bunch of fun stuff from these guys. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. How do I get up there? How do I get up? How do I go, 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 get in here, get up, get up, get up, get it up. Oh, here we go. I made it up. We got some bottle caps. Eh, I guess they got okay stuff. I mean, this is a short pipe rifle, but I know it's better than mine. I don't even feel like dealing with it, you know? Pelvis bones? Why the heck would I want pelvis bones? From a super mutant, nonetheless. Anything fun? Honestly, I don't actually look for things uh, in real life. I just look for things that where it says that there's things. 
when the words actually pop up, you know? That's how I look for things. Because otherwise, it's just like you got to like look at the desk and you got to look around. You're like, oh, what is that? Then you got to look at the words. No, it's better to just look for one thing. And I just like to look for the words. Just makes sense. Here we go. Is this a bag of meat? Oh, God. It is. It's a meat bag. It's a meat bag. Oh, you can go up even higher. Fun. Though I don't think I need a plunger, which I guess is a nice thing. Meat bag. Radioactive gland. I like it. I like it. I don't know what a radioactive gland is, but it sounds kind of uh-oh. Sounds kind of uh-oh. <laughs> Alright, we made it, guys. We've done it. So let's hop down here. And I don't know. Do I get anything for helping these guys or no? Excuse me. See, so you got one of those fancy volt suits. Those one-size-fits-all. We got purified water inside the city. Best drink in the Commonwealth. Okay. So where's Diamond City, actually? If we're... Oh, we're, like, right here. I will absolutely go. Hello, Mr. Turret. Oh, fantastic. Fantastical. Everything outside the wall ain't safe. That's just how it is. Perfect. We discovered it. Wait. Defending Diamond City is nothing me, my boys, the wall, and a few turrets can't handle. Is this Diamond City? Doing your job. Protecting Diamond City means keeping me out, is that it? <laughs> oh, look, it's the scary reporter. I'm sorry, but Mayor McDonough's really steamed, Piper. Saying that article you wrote was all lies. The whole city's in a tizzy. <laughs> in a tizzy. <laughs> You open this gate right now, Danny Sullivan. I live here. You can't just lock me out. <sighs> or can we? Boom, baby. You want into Diamond City, right? I just got here, but yeah. Shh. Play along. What? What's that? You said you're a trader up from Quincy? You have enough supplies to keep the general store stocked for a whole month? <laughs> you hear that, Danny? You gonna open the gate and let us in, or are you gonna be the one talking to crazy Myrna about losing out on all the Whoop. supply? Jeez, all right. I need to make it personal, Piper. Give me a minute. Better head inside quick before old Danny catches on to the bluff. <laughs> Uh-huh. Sounds good. All right. Who let you back inside? I told Sullivan to keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble-rousing slanderer. The level of dishonesty in that paper of yours. I'll have that printer scrapped for parts. Ooh, that a statement, Mr. McDonough? Tyrant Mayor shuts down the press. Why don't we ask the newcomer? You support the news? Because the mayor's threatened to throw free speech in the dumpster. This really isn't any of my business. Oh, I didn't mean to bring you into this argument, good sir. No, no, no. You look like Diamond City material. Welcome to the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Safe, happy, a fine place to come. Spend your money, settle down. Don't let this muckraker here tell you otherwise, all right? Muckraker? <laughs> Whatever. I'm not going to be here long. Uh, another see-no-evil type. You'll fit in just fine with all the inept guards. <laughs> now, was there anything particular you came to our city for? I'm trying to find someone. Trying to find someone? Who? My son, Sean. He's less than a year old. Wait, your son's missing? Oh, you hear that, McDonough? What's Diamond City Security doing to help this man, huh? This isn't the first missing persons report to come through here, and now we have an infant who's been taken? Uh, don't listen to her. Well, I'm afraid that our security team can't follow every case that comes through. I'm confident that you can find help here. Diamond City has every conceivable service known to man. One of our great citizens can surely find the time to help you. 
Well, sure. And a mayor of a great city must know everyone. Who can help me? Well, uh, uh, there is uh, one private citizen, Nick Valentine, a detective of sorts who specializes in tracking people down, usually for debts or whatnot. No, I have to get going. I'm sorry, Diamond City Security doesn't have time to help, but I'm sure Mr. Valentine charges a reasonable fee. This is ridiculous. Diamond City Security can't spare one officer to help. I want the truth, McDonough. What's the real reason security never investigates me? I've had enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. <laughs> I'm impressed. Not everyone can claw information out of McDonough's tight-fisted hands. Hmm. Why don't you stop by my office after you see Valentine? I think I just found my next story. Story of the century. Alright, so we've gotten, like, five new quests that we have to do. We have to finish up the castle thing. we got to go talk to the Valentine. Then we got to talk to her. And then we got to blah, 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 blah. There's so many things going on. But that is all I'm going to have for you guys today. So if you enjoyed the video, press like. And have a super duper delicious day.